As the specter of inflation haunts our economy, everyday commodities are finding themselves perched on the precipice of unaffordability. Essential items, once plentiful, are now in short supply, transforming ordinary stores into barren landscapes. Amid this turmoil, manufacturers are undertaking Herculean efforts to ramp up production, but they are confronted by the harsh reality of a poor harvest season and significant crop losses. Their power to affect change is tragically limited. We stand witness to the distressing panorama of empty store shelves and soaring prices, undeniable testament to a fragmented and faltering supply chain. For many, the task of mending this intricate web of commerce feels insurmountable, a daunting challenge best left for another day. Yet, as the sands of time trickle relentlessly into 2023, the prospect of improvement in the industry appears increasingly bleak. But today, we choose not to dwell on the overtly obvious. We aim to shed light on the overlooked and forgotten elements of this brewing storm. Those seemingly innocuous items we disregard when pondering our defensive strategies against potential food shortages. Be warned, a great number of these products are already dancing on the edge of scarcity. And those that aren't are very likely to join the precarious waltz sooner than expected. Therefore, we advise you to keep an eagle's eye out for these items during your next grocery expedition. As the tempest of crisis accelerates, it is more crucial than ever to heed our counsel and take proactive measures before the nightfall of scarcity engulfs us all. And so, without further delay, we present to you a crucial survival guide. The top 15 food products to stockpile in anticipation of impending food shortages. 1. Quinoa is a powerhouse of nutrition. Packed with protein, fiber, iron, lysine, and magnesium. It's an excellent source of plant-based protein, providing all nine essential amino acids, which is quite rare for plant foods. As such, quinoa is especially beneficial for vegetarians and vegans. Its high fiber content promotes good digestive health and can help regulate blood sugar levels. Quinoa is also gluten-free, making it a fantastic alternative for those with gluten intolerance or celiac disease. For storage, a 25 to 30 pounds bag of quinoa should last a family of four several months if consumed regularly. It's easy to prepare, requiring only water or broth, and can be a base for salads, side dishes, or even breakfast cereal. 2. Lentils and Beans Both lentils and beans are heart-healthy, high in fiber and protein, and low in fat. They're also rich in essential nutrients like iron, magnesium, potassium, and folate, contributing to overall well-being and aiding in red blood cell production. They're extremely versatile, fitting into a range of dishes from soups and stews to salads and curries. Lentils and beans can be stored either dry or canned. Dry lentils and beans, when stored properly, have a virtually indefinite shelf life. Canned options, while quicker and more convenient to prepare, can last for several years. Depending on consumption, storing up to 50 pounds each of dry lentils and beans could provide meals for months. 3. Rice is a fundamental food across the globe, serving as a primary energy source for more than half of the world's population. It provides essential nutrients, including fiber, niacin, vitamin D, calcium, iron, thiamine, and riboflavin. It's also low in sodium and fat, making it a heart-healthy choice. Rice varieties such as brown rice also contain antioxidants. For storage, consider purchasing a 50 pounds bag, which could last a family of four several months. Different types of rice, brown, jasmine, basmati, not only offer variety in taste and texture, but also have slightly different nutrient profiles, which can contribute to a balanced diet. Four, honey is a versatile, long-lasting natural sweetener packed with antioxidants. Its antibacterial and antifungal properties have been used in traditional medicine for centuries. It's rich in phenols, enzymes, and compounds like flavonoids and organic acids. These compounds contribute to honey's antioxidant capacity, which can help fight inflammation and promote heart health. As an unprocessed product, honey doesn't spoil and can be kept indefinitely if stored in a dry, cool place. A few jars of honey could easily last months to years. 5. Oats Oats are a nutrient-dense food, high in fiber and protein, and packed with important vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. They contain a unique type of fiber called beta-glucan, known to help lower cholesterol, improve insulin response, and promote healthy gut bacteria. Oats are also high in antioxidants, which can help lower blood pressure levels. They have a longer shelf life, particularly if stored in airtight containers in a cool, dry place. 
Depending on consumption, a few large bags of oats, up to 50 pounds, should be enough for several months. 6. Canned fruit is a great source of fiber, vitamin C, and other antioxidants. They can be enjoyed on their own, in salads, or used in cooking and baking. The amount to stock up for long-term survival would depend on the size of your household, but around 60, 100 cans would provide a varied fruit intake for a family of four for a few months. Look for fruits canned in their own juice or water to avoid excess sugar. 7. Canned or jarred sauces. Sauces like marinara, curry, or salsa can diversify your meals and add needed flavor. They're also a good source of vitamins and minerals, particularly if they contain vegetables. Depending on the type of sauces, they may offer nutrients like vitamin A, vitamin C, calcium, and iron. For a family of four, 50, 100 jars of various sauces could last several months. 8. Protein bars or shakes. These are dense sources of calories, protein, and various micronutrients. Depending on the brand, they can provide a wide range of vitamins and minerals. For long-term storage, consider having at least a 2-3 month supply. That means roughly 180, 270 units for a daily serving for an individual, or more if you're stocking for multiple people. 9. Salt and Spices Salt is not only a flavor enhancer, but it's also critical for bodily functions, including fluid balance. It helps regulate hydration levels and supports various physiological processes. Additionally, spices contribute to flavor diversity, and some even offer health benefits. For example, turmeric contains curcumin, known for its anti-inflammatory properties, while cinnamon may help regulate blood sugar levels. To ensure you have an adequate supply, consider storing around 3 to 5 pounds of salt and a well-rounded collection of your favorite spices. This quantity should be sufficient to meet your needs for an extended period. 10. Coffee and Tea in addition to providing a much-needed caffeine boost, coffee and tea offer other advantages as well. Coffee is rich in antioxidants, which help protect cells from damage caused by harmful free radicals. On the other hand, tea contains antioxidants and may provide trace amounts of minerals such as manganese. To ensure you have a sufficient supply, it is advisable to stockpile approximately 5 to 10 pounds of coffee and a similar quantity of tea. Whether you prefer bagged or loose-leaf tea, this amount should provide you with a comforting and antioxidant-rich beverage for several months. 11. Instant Meals During emergencies or when time is of the essence, instant meals can be incredibly convenient. While the nutrient content varies across different brands and types, these meals often provide a decent amount of carbohydrates and sodium. These macronutrients are essential for energy production and maintaining electrolyte balance. It is recommended to stockpile around 90, 180 packets of instant meals for a long-term emergency situation. This quantity should offer you a quick and easy meal solution when necessary. 12. Canned Soup Canned soups can serve as a valuable source of nutrition during challenging times. They typically contain protein, fiber, and a variety of essential vitamins and minerals. The nutrient profile may differ depending on the type of soup, but many varieties are rich in vitamin A and iron. To ensure an adequate supply, consider storing approximately 100, 200 cans of soup for a family of four. With this quantity, you should have enough to sustain your family for a few months, providing them with nourishing meals. 13. Baking Supplies Baking supplies are indispensable when it comes to preparing a wide range of foods. Flour, for example, is a versatile ingredient that provides carbohydrates and protein, forming the foundation of many recipes. Sugar acts as a quick source of energy, while baking powder and baking soda are essential leavening agents. To stock up on these supplies for several months of regular baking, it is recommended to store around 50 pounds of flour, 25 pounds of sugar, and a few pounds of baking soda and baking powder. With these quantities, you can enjoy the therapeutic art of baking and create various culinary delights. 14. Pet Food if you have furry companions, it is crucial to consider their dietary needs during long-term situations. Pets require a balanced diet that includes necessary nutrients such as proteins, fats, and fibers tailored to their specific species. To ensure your pet's well-being, it is advisable to have a three, six-month supply of pet food on hand. This quantity should be sufficient to sustain them through extended periods when regular pet food supplies may be limited. Remember to choose pet food that aligns with your pet's nutritional requirements and preferences. 15. Canned tuna is a great source of protein and omega-3 fatty acids. 
It's also a good source of vitamin D and selenium. For long-term storage, having 30-60 cans would provide a substantial amount of animal-based protein. It's also worth considering items like multivitamins and mineral supplements to ensure you're getting all the nutrients you need, especially during a prolonged food shortage. As always, consider your dietary needs and preferences when stocking up. Thank you for watching.